Now, an eight on your side investigation. Contractor in the crosshairs. The Pinellas building contractor, one customer calls, the contractor from hell is in trouble again. We first told you about Rick Metz's pattern of shoddy work and unfinished jobs six months ago in an eight on your side investigation. Well, now the contractor is facing half a dozen more license complaints, and we just caught his crew working on yet another project without a valid permit. Investigative reporter Mark Douglas joining us now to show us what Metz is up to now. Well, Keith and Stacy, an eight on your side viewer alerted us to this project going on at the Copper Mug Plaza in Clearwater, so we checked it out, and it turned out to be a real doozy. It's no fun under a leaky roof on a rainy day. Just ask tenants in the Copper Mug Plaza. They've battled leaks for months. Back in March, building contractor Rick Metz pulled a city permit to repair this roof and hired Daryl Palmer to do the work. I don't get paid until the job's done. That might take a while. Last week, we watched Palmer tackle the job all by himself day after day. He showed up late, left early, and took a lot of smoke breaks in between. If Palmer was looking for help up there, it never came. And from what we saw, he could sure use some. So could his boss, Rick Metz, who bounced the check he wrote to get the roof permit. Because of non-payment, the city of Clearwater issued a stop work order. But that didn't stop Daryl Palmer. Well, that job is on hold, and nobody's supposed to be working on it because Rick Metz bounced the check for the permit. I haven't. That's the first I've heard of it. <laughs> I I'm, I'm, wasn't aware of it, believe me. Not at all. Last November, we quizzed Metz about his five-year history of consumer complaints. Back then, Metz insisted he has a stellar reputation. We do good work. I stand behind my work. But this time around, we couldn't find Metz standing anywhere. Back at Metz's Clearwater headquarters, one of his tenants, Jacenia Martin, told us her boyfriend worked for Metz until they had a falling out. He leaves the job site for like months and months and months. He drags it on and on and on and on and on. The copper mug roofing job has dragged on for 56 days, and it sure looks like it has a long way to go. One of his customers called him the, the contractor, contractor from, from hell. hell. <laughs> it is the truth. I cannot lie. I cannot lie about that. The Pinellas Licensing Board just filed these six complaints against Rick Metz last week related to other shoddy or unfinished jobs and is now looking into the one we just told you about. Now, Metz is referring all of our questions to his lawyer, so we didn't get to talk to him this time around. <laughs> I wouldn't want to talk to you either if you were presenting all that in front of me. But did Metz ever resolve those permit problems? Yes, he did. He eventually squared up with the city, made good on that permit, so he's now legally able to complete that work. It's not clear who's going to do it, however, because Daryl Palmer has apparently been fired uh, from that job, wow. and, uh, you know, we'll see what happens after all of this. We'll, we'll be checking on it. Thank you, Mark. Thanks, Mark. Mm -hmm.